guys. We're going to Laguna Beach alone though. Stop. Look how well we match. Oh my gosh. Also, sticking with the green theme, trying a new flavor, dragon fruit. I feel like this can't be that good. Dragon fruit like doesn't have a flavor. Opening things with acrylics. Ugh. You really gotta harness some techniques when you're doing this. There we go. It's like a subtle mango flavor. It's a yes for me. Let's get back on the road. I need to show you. First of all, there's a really good sign when I walked in. The room number. It's a sign. Look how gorgeous it is. We be safe though. You walk in and it's just a gorgeous little room with the best lighting. We have a little kitchenette, a little seating place with the cutest drink decor, a little couch, and the balcony. How cool is this, you guys? And I have the best ocean view ever. They even have like complimentary like beach umbrella and beach chairs. They gave me like a free room upgrade and I think it came with like an ocean view and I was like, oh, sign me up. How gorgeous is this? I'm like obsessed. This is like the best room ever. Look at the bed. She's so comfy, all for me. Oh yeah, let's talk about that. Hey. I haven't gone on a trip alone in my life before. No, I haven't. And I kind of wanted to. To A, to prove myself I could have fun alone. B, because I wanted to come here. And C, because I had a really important doctor's appointment in Orange County and I had to come here anyway. <laughs> I'm freaking excited because I have so many fun things planned. I did so much research and like places to eat, places to shop, things to do. Like I am just I can't wait to get this trip started, so let's freaking do it. Let's go out and maybe get dinner. Here's the fit for tonight. We have like these long pants that match it. And you guys, this is the comfiest material I've ever felt. It's from Misguided. Obsessed. The details. We love them. Also, I look like a blonde. I'm not, I swear. I swear. There was a sushi place that I wanted to go to called Starfish and I looked it up and it was literally 400 feet away from where I was staying and I was like, okay, perfect. So I'm walking there right now and I already see it. <laughs> Good karma set from free people. Fits me like a glove. I don't think I've ever been to active culture, but that's like a huge thing in LA or like California in a whole, I think. So I want to go try that and then we're gonna go do a little hike. Guys, the next seasonal shake is pina colada. Pina colada? Why? You heard the tea here. <laughs> this is fucking amazing. Very smoothie, something like that. It's so good. It's like really banana-y and like sweet, but like not like overpowering. Chilly at 9 a.m. It's literally 9 a.m. Oh my god. I haven't had chili in the longest time. When it's like a little bit spicy, that's the best. I underestimated how cold it was gonna be here. I always forget that like in California when the sun's not out, it's significantly colder because it's like not humid at all. So it's really cold here because apparently there's a thing called June bloom, gloom, not bloom. And it's constantly cloudy the whole month of June. I did not know that. <laughs> Things 
Like, I definitely recommend that. You don't even have to do it all, but the views were so cool. It is a good day. The sun is out. Remember when I was talking about the June bloom bloom? I'm so excited we got our swimmy on. I passed a really cute like small flower shop and I wanna go see what they have. Look how cute. Oh my gosh, there's so many options. I'm obsessed. the name it's called Brown's Flowers so you guys definitely have to come here if you're in looking Laguna oh, look how cute I'm literally so obsessed and the fact that I had to like build it myself made the whole thing so much more fun this whole thing was like $20 which isn't terrible for like a small flower shop I feel like because for some reason why are flowers so expensive but, like at Trader Joe's they're like a fraction of the price Let's just put these bad boys in here till we get home. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Today is giving good vibes. Earring one, earring two, chopstick one, chopstick two. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is a look. I actually don't even know if I like, this swimsuit is way cuter. Maybe I should just take this off. So many outfit changes today, guys. This is from the brand Heart of Sun Swim and they sent it to me, they, like gifted it to me. Whenever companies gift like things to me, especially things that I'm like obsessed with, I really wanna take pictures for them. So that's what I'm doing. So I wanted to like at least get a picture when the sun's out, so that's what we're doing. This is so cutie. Do you think it's okay if I like walk into a donut shop wearing this? Is that maybe I should just bring it if I'm feeling a little insecure. This donut place we're going to is actually in Costa Mesa, which is like 25, 30 minutes away, which is definitely a little bit of a drive, but I really want to go to it. It's called Sidecar Donuts and they look so good and I am a sweets girl. So you know I have to try it if I'm like here, basically. Look at this beast! We're gonna go get some juices now. You know, you guys, everything in moderation. We're gonna get some donuts, some juices, even it out. Okay, but like that's the most amazing thing about being alone is like I can literally do whatever I want. I'm getting donuts and juices right now. No one can tell me I can't. I love solo trips. Made it to the beach, guys. So funny, I've never come alone before. And I have like a big old box of donuts, it's just so funny. Look how good they look though. Oh my gosh. I should like rearrange them cuter. These actually look way too good to eat. But I'm starving so I will devour them. Stop. It's almost like a cake donut mixed with a glazed donut. Hmm. I literally can't stop. Lemon poppy seed. Hmm. The lemon is so strong. Why does the ocean actually scare me after my whole Hawaii trip fiasco? Like, whatever happened to me in the ocean? Now I'm terrified. Huckleberry. This one is a lot better than I thought it was gonna be. Oh my god. Stop it. These are so good. I'm gonna eat the whole thing. And the next outfit is sponsored by Von Dutch. You guys can get these hats for 25% off if you click. <laughs> Why am I doing That was like so serious. No, but I just like really think this hat is so sick. Oh, and the shirt. 2000s vibes. I passed a really cool looking crystal shop and I was like, I need to go there. It had singing bowls and if they're a decent price, I might think about getting one because I've been wanting one for a really long time. This is what drawn me in you guys, the singing bowls. Whoa. Okay guys, look at the rings. The aquamarine in the middle, my middle fingers. I can't decide. It's like the hardest decision. Yeah, I mean, I kind of feel like this one because it's gold and this one's rose gold. All the ring options, guys. Ah! I'm so hyped about it! I went in and instantly looked at all the scene goals and they were so much money, like thousands of dollars. And then I was like, ugh, this is like one of those expensive like boutiques with crystals in it. And I was like, F. Then I was just like looking around and I found the rings and I was like, I don't even want to ask how much they are because I know they're going to be way more than I can afford. And she was like, CC5. And I was like, like CC500 or 65. And she was like, 65. And I was like, 
period. I was drawn to these like blue ones. It's aquamarine. I'm so hyped about it. I literally think it looks like a wedding ring. Oh, and it's adjustable so like it can fit on any of my fingers. Thank God. Dude, I'm just like actually in love with it. There's a place called Chakra Shack that I've been wanting to go to, so let's go there. Chakra Shack. Ooh. Holy. Okay, so they do aura readings here, and I'm not like super familiar with all of that stuff, but I think it's a really cool like, topic, so I'm gonna get my aura read. I'll take a picture of you, and like you get to analyze it and everything, so I'm really excited. I just got it. It was only like $25. Not all of them, but at least the ones in your left hand. Because we, we're gonna have your hand on here, and I don't want it to be. One, two, three. Holy shit, that was so much more insightful than I thought it was gonna be. First of all, look at the pig. I got flicked up there. I'm a very orange, yellow aura, which I thought. I'm not gonna go too in depth with it because I know it's not everyone's dealio, but orange is a very artistic, physical, creative expression and excitement. And I'm like, holy shit, that, that's very much me. But she also went into my chakras and I'm not gonna show you them because that's personal. But actually I will, I don't really give a shit. They all mean something, the size, how bright they are, they all mean something. And I think it's so interesting and she was telling me a little bit about it and I was like, oh, it's just so cool. I should probably eat food. <laughs> It takes true balls to vlog by yourself in the middle of a restaurant. The key is, you just don't look at anybody else, then you can't get embarrassed. This salsa looks kind of dark and questionable. <laughs> I met these girls at Wild Taco. I literally just went up to them and was like, hey. And we got gelato together. So it was like so random and fun, but I'm tired. Hot girl morning routine. Good morning, folks. I just left my hotel. I actually really highly recommend you guys to come here if you stay. The rooms, as you saw, were adorable. Everything was like remote check-ins. All the information got sent to your phone, which was so cool, and your key was on your phone too, which made everything so much easier. Laguna Beach Lodge. Let's go get some breakfast though. I'm freaking hungry. We're gonna eat at this place called Zinc. It has like a bunch of different things, apparently. Yum, you guys, I got a chocolate croissant for rush squeezed orange juice and a Mediterranean omelet with like feta and spinach. So then I found this place called The Bead Shop and you guys, this place is so cool. They have thousands of beads to choose from and basically you can create your own necklace, bracelets, or even like rings. They had so many freaking options. Look at all of these. So I picked out my little charms and I got to work. I made my necklace and the two girls working there also helped me and oh, it turned out so cool. Let me just show you the cutie necklaces I made. Uh, I love it when they get tangled. First of all, they helped me make this shorter, which I'm really excited about. I made this. There's a smiley face, it says Gemini. There's two pearls, there's a wing, a cowboy hat, and a little diamond. I'm obsessed and I just think it's so cute. It was so fun how you could like literally choose all the charms and pick it out yourself and make it. I also just got this one. It's like really short so I can like stack it with other things. I also got this ring, the beaded one right here. In all, it was like $85. I'm just so glad I went on this trip. It literally made me so much more confident in myself. It made me learn so much about myself and made me get out of my comfort zone a lot. And I really want you guys to do something like this. You don't have to go on a whole trip because that's maybe too much. 
You can do as little as going out to get ice cream by yourself or going out to get dinner by yourself or going on a long walk by yourself, but just learning to do things with yourself and keep yourself company. Like I've been talking to myself, like I've been with a friend. Like you just have to learn to befriend yourself. I'm obsessed with myself now. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, but it, this trip literally was so much fun. I'm obsessed with Laguna Beach. This is my first time coming here and I definitely wanna come back with people, maybe people this time. I hope you guys loved this video. Let me know what your favorite part was or if you took away anything from this video because I've been responding to like a bunch of my comments lately and I've been hearting a bunch. So make sure to subscribe and I will see you guys next Thursday.